Welcome to Buzz, Indiana Underground Business Voice. My name is Tony Selza. We're here with George Niederkorn with Network Engineering Inc. That's correct. Finally got it right. It was three takes to get it there. Now, you got one of the best hockey names in Rainmakers, but there's a lot more going on at your company and what you do. Talk to me about what I, I think it's a network admin company, but what is it really you, you guys do all day? We provide uh, technology consulting services and infrastructure support to local Indiana businesses and um, and certain technologies provide uh, expertise into enterprise technologies such as maybe messaging or antivirus security, faxing, that sort of thing. So what that means to the layman, right? I mean, is I have a network, I need it to communicate with the world, right? Correct. I need it to interact with the internet and you keep it up 24 seven, 365. Correct, there's a lot of companies that don't maybe have uh, IT support maybe insufficient support, looking to save some money, or just maybe want an extra pair of eyes to kind of gaze over what they're doing, sure. either on a day-to-day -day basis or for specific projects. So. Now, George, there's a lot of companies in your space, and we got a few in Rainmakers that are in your space. What is it that makes you different? What is, what is it? Is it your target market? Is it the expertise? Is it, is it your guys are just the super geeks that help the other geeks? Talk to me about what that means. I think more so than anything, um, our president and owner, Dave Spilker, has worked uh, for 25 years in Indianapolis, yeah. um, building good rapport and learning a lot about uh, the environment and the companies here in Indy. Um, and that's really helped us sustain some longevity yeah. and provide support to uh, companies that have a gambit of different technology problems. Now, George, what would you say is your perfect client, your ideal client? Is it like, is it law firms? Is it the architecture firms? Is it is it the professional services? The, the companies that have that high dollar value per hour? Yeah, we're really looking for, for companies that maybe um, provide professional services, like you said, uh, law firms, architectural firms, um, manufacturing companies that maybe don't have a ton of IT support, but still have a need. Sure, the kind of companies that have that maximum importance for being up all the time, right? right. Being able to use their their network to deliver their intelligence. Somebody that understands that the technology is a necessity in their business and can't afford to have it down or, or missing those critical parts. So d does that get you guys into the game with uh, doing some staff augment, maybe even supporting other networks and having them do what they, you know, making sure they get where they, they need to go? Yeah, I, I think it does. Um, you know, a, a lot of the companies maybe uh, are missing that sort of expertise and, and we can help them to, to get up to speed um, whether they're trying to get uh, some support from another company working with other companies and that sort of thing. Great. What is the one thing that you would, um, the one thing that you would think makes you different from all the other players in that space? What's that one thing that you guys always seem to come back to that gets you moving down the road and gets you winning clients from other people? I think uh, the engineers that, that we've hired um, have a, a wide array of, of backgrounds and that helps us to tackle a lot of different problems that arise whether it's with software or uh, telephone systems networking that sort of thing so we don't run across too many solutions that uh, we can't come up with some sort of you guys have the ability to chase down the problem no matter what the problem right right george Dieter, Dieter corn i got it right again you've been buzz appreciate you thanks thank so you much. so much I, oddly enough a hockey coach too correct right south stars